a blessed day and welcome the verse for meditation this morning comes to us from the book of luke chapter 1 and 30 but the angel said to her do not be afraid mary you have found favor with god as we meditate on today's scripture we see that even mary the mother of jesus when she was called displayed a certain degree of fear and anxiety but the angel gabriel assured her that because of god's favor upon her she had no need to fear adoniram judson and his wife were the first commissioned foreign missionaries in american history adoniram spent almost 40 years in burma which is now the nation of myanmar during his ministry he helped lead hundreds of burmese people from the current tribe to saving faith in jesus christ translated the bible and other christian writings into two different languages wrote numerous booklets and tracts on a variety of theological topics and encouraged baptists in america to unite for the sake of gospel missions but all these came at a cost the judsons were frequently acquainted with sickness suffering and death they lost three children in 1824 the burmese emperor imprisoned nearly all western men as presumed spies for the british government this included adoniram who spent 19 months in two different prisons including one overseen by convicted murderers who had been spared death in exchange for serving as jailers many prisoners died but ann adoniram's wife was devoted to keeping her husband alive she pestered begged and bribed so that she could provide food for her imprisoned husband she even managed to give adoniram his personal pillow into which was sewn his translation of the burmese bible all the while ann was nursing an infant and raising two orphaned burmese girls shortly after adoniram's release and his wife died followed by his daughter maria which caused him to live in seclusion he dug his own grave and spent many hours contemplating death the jungle was tiger infested and many locals feared adoniram would be eaten when he returned safely from his self exile everyone was surprised he had survived over the course of 1830 adoniram increasingly emerged from his spiritual darkness with a new resolve to reach burma for christ he enjoyed a decade of evangelistic fruitfulness especially among the tribal karen people he also continued his translation work and mentored the sturdy stream of younger baptist missionaries coming to burma to work among the burmese and karen dear beloved ones each of us has a purpose and has been born according to the will of god in this time and age to fulfill a calling nothing else in this world will be able to complete or bring satisfaction to our lives until we consent to the call of god wholeheartedly just like mary we must remember that the journey is not rosy rather full of obstacles and challenges but we find comfort in trusting god's wisdom and infinite knowledge if god has called us he is definitely able to fulfill the purposes in our lives as well therefore let us trust him in everything we do let us pray abba father help us to remain faithful in trial 
knowing that you are faithful to see us through it all. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Shalom Maranatha.